Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is about fixing the issue while launching the game GTA 5 and Hans version. You got an error of fail to initialize graphic device with error ERR GFT INIT. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. In the basic step, as the error is recommended, go ahead and simply download the latest version of DirectX into your PC. Here is the official website of Microsoft. Simply scroll down and click on this download link. Once it is downloaded, save it into your system and after the file is downloaded, click on it and install the latest version of DirectX into your system. Once it is installed, restart your PC and then relaunch the game and hopefully this will fix out the issue. Now if this method failed to work out, let's proceed with the second step. First of all, I'll go ahead and check the DirectX version into your system. So click on start menu and type in DXDIAG. Once you find the program, click on it to open the DXDIAG version into your system. Now click on the display tab and over here under the DirectX, you will find the level which is supported by your system. To play GTA 5 enhanced version, you need DirectX version 12 as it is showing right over here. And even in 12, you must have feature level 12 underscore 1 as it is showing right in this corner. Now if both these options are not available into your system, you need to change the requirement from DX12 to DX11. And to do so, open up your browser and here you need to download this program script. Click on this and choose the second link which is release binaries release dot zip. Click on it and save it into your system. Once the file is saved, you need to open the zip folder and you will find a file d3d12.dll. Right click and choose option copy. Once it is copied, you need to paste this file into the game directory. At my end, the game is installed in F drive, Rockstar Games, GTA 5. So I'll go ahead, right click and choose option paste to paste this particular file right over here. After pasting the file, restart your PC and after restarting, the issue of ERRGFX INIT fail to initialize graphic device will be completely fixed out. However, if the issue is still there, the only reason you are not able to play the game is because your system does not support direct X12 feature level 12 underscore world. Because to play the game, you need at least Intel i7 4th generation processor with a minimum of 4 GB of VRAM into your graphic card. So if these are not supported, you can only play the GTA 5 legacy version. I hope it clears all your doubt regarding this particular error. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.